Hey, what's good, dudes? Welcome back to Beaker's Lab. My name is Beaker. How are we doing? What's good? Welcome back to the show, guys. I'm Beaker. I'm back. Lulu is here. She hasn't been here for like days because it's finally not super hot up here. So Lulu's here. What's good? <laughs> That's kind of funny. I got her like out more so you guys can see her. Hey, what's good, Lou? Anyway, guys, we're back today. We're on the town online account in Clash of Clans, and we're gonna check in with what happened yesterday. So if you guys were here yesterday, you saw we were doing a war, right? And I was sort of still sick, I was sort of still loopy, but I did a good war attack. But we were really behind. We were gonna lose this war. It looked really bad. I didn't say that to you guys, <laughs> but it did. It looked really bad. Guys, let me show you what happened. War log. Oh! Wait, let me, let me click on it. Oh! <laughs> Are you joking? Guys, look at the score. 56 to 56, tied up. And the only thing... Thank you, Cholo. You... Okay, Cholo, thank you, but... You're killing me right now. Okay, the only thing that got us the win was 1%. 1 1.2%? Dude, that is crazy. I love to see wins like this. It's pretty much just a, you know, it's like a, a coin flip almost. Like, anybody could have won this. It was down to percentage. I love to see that. So before we do anything, I want to show you guys the other attack that I did. Where, Where is it? Where is it? What's up? What's up? What's up? Where, where am I? What? Oh, Grandad. That's right, dude. Grandad. I hit, I hit up Grandad. Which was funny because Grandad also hit up me. What's good, homie? I hope he watches this. I hope he's like, yeah, thanks for calling me granddad, you dork. <laughs> I, can't, I can't say your name. I'm going to say granddad. Okay, so I, where are we starting here? Oh, okay, cool. Up here. Good job, Beak. Uh, kind of a weird, weird idea. Uh, not really sure why I wanted to start here because, yeah, what do you, what's, your, what's your queen going to do up here? Going to take out that? Good. Good, good play, Beak. Good play. I mean, there might have been a better spot I could start here, but it's all good. It's all good. Now, look at the army. If you guys weren't here yesterday, we did the same army yesterday, and I don't know where it came from. I just sort of threw it together, and it worked. Like, I don't know how it worked. Oh, what's good? Hey, air bomb. Hey, what's up? So we dropped the rage bell there. Normally, I just choke on that. I just screw that up. We didn't screw up today. We got the rage bell down just in time. Now, uh, we only have a couple more spells. It's kind of spooky. You know, we only have a jump and, and two heals at this point, so we got to be very careful with them. Now, look at this crew right here. I was super stoked about this crew right here because we got the golem up front and we got a bunch of clearing troops here. Hang on. Oh, Tesla's. Oh, this Tesla right here, dude. This Tesla right here was like about to kill me. I was having a heart attack here looking at this Tesla because look, it's trying to kill all of our really important troops. Baby D goes down, but the enemy queen is already down. We opened up the wall here. It's going down. Check it out. Guys, it was pretty scary, though. It's pretty scary because this hound, what's the hound going to do? I don't know. We'll see him later. But guys, here we go. Everybody in the middle now is just ground troops. So they're not even going to worry about that hound. They don't even care. They're like, whatever. Get, go away. King is leading the, leading the pack here. He's kind of dying. Kind of dying. Where's my healers? Oh, they're back here. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Air traps. So yeah, it looks like the king's going to go down, right? King, where you at? Oh, wow, look at that king, man. Uh, kind of a terrible heal spell, Beak. What's up with that? Well, I guess the heal spell is getting a little bit of the hogs, giving the hogs some love a little bit. How is this king still alive? Are you kidding me? What? What? It's like the unstoppable king, dude. He's still alive. Couple of Valks around, couple of bowlers. You're kidding me. So, hey, look at this, man. So if you don't kill a hound, look at what it does. I mean, it just follows you around. It does nothing. It does nothing, like, where does that, whoa, hey, that thing that the hound shoots, where does that come out of? It certainly doesn't come out of its arms. That's spooky. Okay, so that is that. The hound looks like it's not gonna pop. I mean, I don't think so, right? There's like one archer following it around. And I was like, oh, archer, can we not do that? Well, whatever, we'll see what happens. But over here, the queen is still going strong. This was the thing that got us the win here. Queen, still going strong. She may be level 20, but if she stays alive, it's a wrap. It's a wrap, it's a wrap. So yeah, it looks like the, the hound is not even gonna die. I love that, man. Like, I didn't know that this dude had a hound, so that just worked perfectly. But if he if he had something else, this might have not worked. All right, buddies, let's go up the list here. I want to show you guys one more. At least one more. We're, we'll probably look at a couple more. Uh, this one right here, Cholo. What's good? That's my homie. What's, what's up? He's number eight, and he's attacking number eight. But see the big difference between these two? Cholo is actually a town of 10. What is happening over here, man? Oh! Dude, that guy, that guy had all of his red air bombs right there. That is crazy. How did that... Wow, that, that baby D should be dead. You should be dead. You should be dead right now. Wow. Anyway, um, yeah, what was I saying? Cholo's a town hall 10. He's a town hall 9.5, if you will. He's 
you know, whatever he is, he is. Uh, so he has bowlers. He has five spells, but really he's pretty close to this guy. I mean, they both have level 30 heroes pretty much. Cholo just has a slight advantage. Let's see what he can do with that slight advantage. Also, he has bowlers. I mean, that's kind of a massive advantage, not slight. Anyway, let's see what they can do. Homie has a hound, just like the last guy. Uh, kind of kind of popular in this clan. I don't see a lot of people in my clan using hounds on defense. But to each his own, bro. Do whatever you want. Whatever. What's good? So, a queen, how you doing? You look like crap right now. You're just so confused. Oh, no. She's gonna die. She's totally gonna die. Uh, queen ability. Okay, that's gonna keep her alive for a little longer. Now, let's zoom out and see what is going on here. So he's going in with the with the hogs, and because he's a 10 all 10, he has five spells, and that's gonna help a lot because he has one heal there and then two more. Let's see what they what they can do. Hey, what's up with that poison, Cholo? When are you gonna drop that? Never? Okay. Well played. Uh <laughs> I would have freaked out by now and I would have dropped that poison. He apparently does not believe in that. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh, good call, though. Good call, though. He wanted to kill that lava pup. Totally agree with you, Cholo. That's why you're smarter than me. That's why I just work here. You're smarter than me. Whoa, double bombs. Almost took him out there, but he had another heal spell. Wow. <laughs> Can you imagine if he didn't have that heal spell? He he might have still done it, but I don't, I don't even know. I don't know. Anyway, Wiz up there taking some stuff out, but the hogs are going to do most of the work. There's one more cannon over here, and once that thing's down... I think this raid is just a wrap. I think it's gonna be real quick. Yeah, 30 seconds to finish up this base. That's cool, man. That's cool. So this is obviously why you you would wanna do kind of a Town Hall 9.5 kind of thing. You go to Town Hall 10, but you focus on your offense. You get your spell factory upgraded. You get bowlers really quickly. You get them upgraded, uh, stuff like that. And that's clearly what Cholo has done here. I think we should probably go back and I just wanna show you guys Cholo's base. I don't really remember what it looks like, but I think he's like, basically not working on defenses. Let, let's check it out real quick. Yeah, so you can see Cholo's base here. Exactly. He's a Town Hall 9 still, basically. As far as defenses go, he hasn't built anything new, but he's just working on the offense. And you guys want to focus on that if you're going to do this. It's it's super fun. You look, he just did the camps. You guys know how this works. You do the camps, you do the troops, you do the heroes if you can, uh, and the spells, you know, stuff like that. It gives you such a, such a sick advantage. Anyway, thank you, Cholo. <laughs> Who attacked him? Who attacked him? It was a... Wow. Whoa. We got to watch this, man. So this guy is a is a Town Hall 9. Yeah. Totally. He totally is. East Coast Chris. What's up, dude? How you doing? So he's got 10 witches. This is going to be a pretty cool raid. And to be honest, I've been wanting to do this kind of an attack. I've really been wanting to do this, and I keep forgetting to do it. Uh, I gotta try this, man. I want to use more healers, though. I want to use, like, six or seven healers with ten witches. Do something like this. We'll try that soon, guys. But uh, first, I just want to look at this because it'll give me some ideas. Some ideas of what I want to do. So he's got two healers on each of these groups, about four witches in each group. And they're holding their own, man. Whoa! That witch almost died. It, oh, no. Oh. <laughs> okay. So he lost one witch there. Battling the king here. Um, I don't know. Yeah, the king's the king's fine. It's not gonna kill anybody. It's fine. The king is just being dumb. Like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Cholo must have been so pissed. His king was so dumb. So now East Coast Chris. What up? It's such a sick name, right? East Coast Chris. He's, <laughs> they call me East Coast Chris. Yeah, he's going in here with a golem in the front. I love that. Double jump here. Two jumps. Wow. And it's almost like why because nobody's even in the middle it's only it's only the queen pretty much the king is over here but he's gonna die and the rest of the crew is just a couple witches over there and over here as well and a couple bowlers he must have had bowlers in the clan castle so guys i would i would count on that group over there to do most of the work queen in the middle she's gonna do some work as well but what's up over here what is this what is this crew doing are you kidding how is the king still alive how what? Oh, man. You know what else is shocking? Like, how did this guy go from the other side of the queen? And the queen's not even... The queen didn't do anything. The queen did nothing. I feel like that was me. I would have choked right there. I would have failed so bad. He did drop a poison on the queen, though, on Cholo's queen. So that definitely helped. Excuse me? I... Okay, thank you. Thank you. That... <laughs> I almost said a bad word there. That... Freaking king almost 
lived through the whole raid. I, I, I'm not cool with that. I'm not cool with that, dude. That king should have been dead like an hour ago. So yeah, there's the queen gonna clean up everything. And you know what I like about this type of raid? It just sweeps through the base. Sweeps right through the base. You know with hogs, like in that last raid, ton of cleanup? No, no, no. No, 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 no. No cleanup necessary here. Two more buildings left. Now one. Boom, it's a wrap. Cool. That was cool. East Coast Chris, shout out to you. That was a sick raid. Looked really easy too. Like he made it look super easy. That's why we gotta try this, man. We really gotta try this. Homies at Town All Nine, and he just he just killed Cholo like it was nothing. So that's pretty cool. Hey, I just noticed Cholo <laughs> Cholo has upgraded a bunch of his walls. Wow, he's got a bunch of max walls. I mean max Town All Ten walls. Uh, but he but he hasn't done any defenses. I love that dude. I love that. You and my boy. All right, buddies, that's it for today. Thanks for coming out. Good to see you, bros. Uh, thanks to Lulu for coming out as well. How you doing, buddy? She's just like super chill right now. She's got like, she <laughs> like has no neck, just like meh. Cool. Thanks for coming out, Lou. And thank you guys for coming out. If you enjoyed the video, leave us a like, leave us a comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Guys, you can see right here, this is the next thing we're going to do. Next time we do a Clash video, whoa. <laughs> next time we do a Clash video, we're doing this. We're doing the king. I want to do the king. I don't care about the queen, but I want to do the king one more time. It's 120,000 dark elixir, so we only need a little bit more. Poquito. Is that the right word? I think so. Anyway, guys, that's it for today. Like I said, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you next time. Peace. <laughs>